Hi, my name is Jolene Teo. I'm from Singapore and today I'll be showcasing my CS50X final project. My final project is built on the things that we learned in week 9. It uses Flask to control its backend. JavaScript is mainly what deals with the animations and logic handling on the front end. So as you can see here, we have uh, one elevator. If someone's on floor 2 and they press the up button, the elevator will move up. Let's say the person enters the elevator and they want to go floor 3. They will press 3 and it will go up. So it's a very simple elevator. Um, it, it was a lot harder than I expected to create this. And there is a settings here. This is where Flask comes into play because we can set the number of elevators and floors there will be. As you can see here now, there are more floors. Um, the algorithm works via closest elevator. So it does actually check which is the best elevator to choose. For example, right now, um, let's say someone is standing at this side here and they want to go down. They press this button, but this elevator opens instead because it's the closest one. It's already there. There are queues and standby systems in this program. And I would say that uh, this works pretty well as an elevator, to be honest. Um, yeah, we can see here that it follows. So yes, that is it. That's my final project. I'm Jolene and this was CS50.